Welcome to Illustrate to Educate. Please subscribe and ring the bell for more simple and objective videos on topics that matter. Have you ever wondered where St. Patrick's Day came from? In this video, we'll cover everything you need to know about the holiday. St. Patrick's Day is a holiday celebrated annually on March 17th in honor of St. Patrick, the patron saint of Ireland. The origins of the holiday can be traced back to the life of St. Patrick himself, as well as to the traditions of the Irish people. St. Patrick was a Christian missionary who lived in the 5th century. He is said to have been born in Britain, but was later kidnapped and taken to Ireland as a slave when he was 16 years old. After six years of captivity, he escaped and returned to Britain, but later returned to Ireland as a missionary where he spent the rest of his life spreading the Christian faith and building churches. St. Patrick died on March 17th, which is now celebrated as St. Patrick's Day. The holiday became an official feast day in the Catholic Church in the early 17th century, and has since become a popular secular holiday as well. The traditional color of St. Patrick's Day is green, which is associated with Ireland and the shamrock, a symbol that St. Patrick used to explain the concept of the Holy Trinity to the Irish people. The holiday is also associated with drinking and parades, which are thought to have originated in the United States in the mid-19th century. The first St. Patrick's Day Parade took place in New York City in 1762, when Irish soldiers in the British Army marched through the city to celebrate their Irish heritage. The holiday has since evolved into a celebration of Irish culture and heritage, and is now observed by people of all backgrounds and nationalities around the world, with parades, festivals, and other cultural events. What traditions do you celebrate on St. Patrick's Day? Don't forget to like the video and support more simple and objective videos on topics that matter. If you haven't already, please subscribe to Illustrate to Educate and check out some of my other videos to the right.